Welcome to the channel. In this tutorial, we will see how we can write a simple Go program to check whether the number entered by the user is even or odd. In order to say whether a number is even or odd, what we do is we take the number and we divide it by two and we check the reminder value that we get. If we get the reminder as zero, that means that the number is an even number. If the reminder is a non-zero value, then it means that the number is a odd number. Now in Go programming language, in order to get the reminder value, when we divide a value by another value, we use an operator called as the modulus operator, which is denoted by this percentage symbol. For example, to get the reminder value, when we divide 10 by 2, we need to write 10 modulus operator 2. So here, this will return the reminder value when we divide 10 by 2. So we will be using these things and we will write the program. And the first thing that we do is we will specify the package. The package will be main because in Go language, the execution will start from the main function of the main package and then we will uh, import the packages that we need in this program we want to read some value from the user and we want to display some value to the screen and that functionality is supported by a package called as fmt or fmt so we will import this package so it will be import fmt fmt and after that we will write the main function from where the execution will start so it will be function main and inside this main function the first thing that we do is we will ask the user to enter a number so i'm going to use a function available in the formed package so it will be fmt dot i'm going to use the print function and here i'm going to specify the message as enter a positive number and after that what we can do is we can uh, read the number entered by the user and we need to store that number in a variable so we will declare the variable so it will be where and i'm going to call this variable as num and it will be of type integer okay now the next thing that we do is we will uh, read the number entered by the user and for that also we will use a function available in the fmt package so it will be fmt dot scan f which will allow us to read the uh, you know input from the user in a formatted way so we will read an integer value so i'm going to use the format specifier as percentage d and then we need to specify the address of the variable where we want to store in this case we want to store the value entered by the user or the number entered by the user in this num variable so we need to provide the address of this num variable so we will use the ampersand symbol which is the address of operator and now we have the number that the user has entered we just have to check whether this number is even or odd as i said before what we do is we take the number and we divide it by two and we check the reminder value. We will be using the modulus operator. We want to know the reminder value when we divide the number entered by the user by two. So we will perform num modulus operator two and we want to check that reminder value. So whether that reminder value is zero or whether it is a non-zero value so we will use the if else conditional statement so here we will say if the reminder value that we get when we divide the value present in this number variable by two whether that is zero or not if it is zero then it means that the number entered by the user is a even number so we will display that to the screen so again we will use the formed package and we will use a function and let us say this time we will use the printf function and we can say percentage d is even and here we will display uh, the value present in this num variable so if the user is going to enter let us say 4 
then it will display 4 is even okay what if the reminder value that we get here is a non-zero value for that we will have the else part and if we come to the else part then it means that uh, the reminder value is a non-zero value it means the number entered by the user is a odd number so we will display that to the screen here i'm gonna say odd okay now here in this if statement i'm just using the parenthesis to group the calculation that we are doing that is uh, we are performing uh, num modulus 2 to get the reminder value then we are checking that whether that value is zero or not okay now we have uh, written the program in here let's run this enter a positive number i'm gonna say two and it will say two is even i'm gonna run it one more time and this time i'm gonna say five and it says five is odd so this is how we can write a simple go program to check whether the number entered by the user is even or odd if you like this video hit the like button if you don't like it then hit the dislike button if you want to say something then write that in the comment box for more tutorials like this do subscribe to the channel thank you for watching i'll see you later in the next video